All right, so this rolling casket is a 1992 Geo Metro three-cylinder five-speed. This is the original motor in this car. It's got about 270-something thousand miles on it, if I remember correctly. I've owned this car for probably 11 years. I drove it for probably five or six. It started burning an excessive amount of oil, and I parked it. And it's been sitting in this spot pretty much untouched, never started in at least four years probably. So I want to see if this thing will start and creep its way out of my yard. I used to love this little thing, and I still do in a way. It was 50 miles a gallon, which is awesome. But it's got a flat tire, so we'll have to air that up and we get a hot battery. I'll show you around this thing, and uh, we'll see if it'll start. I'm curious. The oil is full, over full really. And check the antifreeze, make sure it hadn't froze. Shouldn't have. Yeah, still pretty full. Okay, let's get a hot battery and uh, see if this thing will turn over. Spitters on the car almost. Uh, the cables are reach. I'm doing my good. Oh. Gross. Uh, let's see. So it's got half a tank in it. But probably rotten gas. Let's see if it'll start. Didn't turn over five times. That amazes me. If this thing started missing, like on a cylinder, you knew it, because it would barely pull itself. It's not good. Hey, the cooling fans work. I hear them kicking on. That's good. I am going to add some fresh gas to this. Probably got a few gallons in here. Two or three. Um, just some fuel stabilizer. Maybe that'll help. This thing probably won't get started again for another seven years.
Let's take it for a ride, shall we? Brake pedal is just a little spongy. But it doesn't hit the floor. Yeah, it does. about it just rolling away so probably six months before this car was parked I put new lower control arms on it new wheel bearings um, tie rod ends outer and inner um, what else did I do struts the whole front end basically and then I basically parked it so brakes were new but uh, they're not new now let's see if we can drive this thing up the road and uh, break loose the uh, stuck wheels. Got half a tank of fuel in it. A little over half tank and it's not getting hot. That's a good thing. There she is for now anyway. I may actually end up fixing this car. It's not a whole lot wrong with it really, other than almost everything. Old parts car. That one was free too. But it had thrown a rod, this one did. It's been sitting up here for years. Let's see if I Get the head off of it. It's got a big old hole in the back of the motor. There she is. There's how big the cylinders are. 
A little bigger than a Coke can. Got a coffee cup, maybe. Well, that's it. I think it pulled itself up on the hill successfully. It ran good. I'm surprised. As cheap as those little cars were, they really weren't that bad. If you can get 270,000 miles out of a bottom end and a transmission, it's about as good as about anything that I can think of. So that's it, I think. I'm glad it started and I didn't have to mess with it for four hours because it's pretty cold out here. So that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. Send me an email if you need anything. Click on my little guy to subscribe to the channel if you haven't. And that's it. So thanks for watching, guys. And see you next time.